anybody's ever had a tooth ache, it's the worst pain. And, and mine had blew up and my whole face had blew up too. So it was like the tooth had taken over my whole body. And you know, that pain right there caused a whole pain in my whole face, whole body ache, throbbing. This is the worst pain ever, man. Please, somebody save me. And to the rescue, Dr. Basically, it boils down to uh, the golden rule. You treat people how you want to be treated. And me, as being a patient, I would want to be well informed on what I'm getting um, and why I'm getting it. Some of the people that came through the office, uh, entertainers, um, artists, uh, comedians, um, choreographers, and um, to be able to take care of them in a uh, uh, painless way is critical because these guys are on uh, national TV, they are doing huge concerts, so the last thing they need is a tooth problem that can prevent them from being able to perform. I go to this doctor and I'm thinking that, you know, he's really going to help me. He looks at my tooth and he says, man, you need to just pull a tooth. I say, you know what? I don't really want to pull my tooth. So I got in my car immediately and left this dentist and I went to doc, um, to his office and I went in and he looked at my tooth and he was like, man, you don't need to pull your tooth, man. You good. You know what I'm saying? I can, I can fix this. And you know, I was like, for real? Cause everybody else had told me I needed to pull the tooth. Um, and he told me, man, I got you, man, for real. He showed me, he printed it out. He had the screen, he had the flat screens and all the stuff. And he showed me what was wrong with my tooth. And, um, and he fixed it. He just did some things that, you know, the other doctors couldn't do. The experience I had at Dr. Schwartz's office just from walking in the door, uh, his office was very inviting, very comfortable and relaxing. And whenever I was in the chair, um, he just made me feel very comfortable. Um, you can tell he's passionate about his work. Uh, me being able to watch TV was a plus always. And um, yeah, just the whole time I just felt relaxed. My relationship to the general dentist is basically an extension to make sure their patients are receiving the optimum um, level of dental care. He actually practiced general dentistry coming out. So the ability to have a specialist that understands the role of the general dentist, I think that helps in uh, the way you treat patients. They see things from a general dentist perspective. There are times when we worked on cases together and he's mentioned, well, you might want to check this or you might want to do this. Um, from a general dentist perspective, not from an endodontic perspective, that's helped me become like a better dentist. The way we practice now, the patients are getting a much better dental experience than say, you know, one person trying to do everything. You can't be perfect at it all. Technically and skillfully is very good at what he does. It ain't for everybody. Uh, Welcome to Hollywood, baby. A picture. Uh -huh. Coming with? Let's not even talk about it. Let's do it. Let's go. Huh? I see your jealousy as you watch me. I see you watching me, baby. You watch me. It's all good.